You walk around this city during sunrise and of course you see no shortage of runners, but one running organization has an especially meaningful cause behind it. Here's our Evan Kozlov. Six, eight, 12, 13, 22, 24. A morning stretch followed by a morning prayer. God, grant me the serenity to accept the things that I cannot change. All before a morning run to the Capitol. But for some, the path to this run has been long. And I'm not just talking about miles. That was a horrible time. It was a time where I worked, you know, but I drank. Even though I worked, I was a function and I hate to say it, drunk. This is Lance taking a break from running to share his story. For years, he's been battling homelessness. Well, it kind of got a little progressive with the drinking. Then I started using controlled substance for pain, you know what I'm saying? Then it went from there to also street drugs, which took me in a spiral downfall. But his life started to turn around when he found this community. It's called Back on My Feet. Three days a week, community members join the homeless for a run. Let's go. And showing up can be pretty rewarding for people like Lance. After 30 days, those with high attendance get access to educational support, job training, and other resources. I lost everything. Andre is also homeless and says this program literally saved his life. Uh, it teaches me how to maneuver around life's obstacles instead of just running from them, but run through them. But more than resources, this run is about community and connecting the homeless to others. Danny Cushman is one of the youngest runners. It's fun because like on our runs, we get to talk, we get to run, we get to race sometimes at the end. And his mom says that's the lesson she's trying to teach by bringing him here. We desensitize ourselves from homelessness. You kind of see people on the street and you just pass them by, like you don't even look at them, you don't see them, you just, you're desensitized to it these days. But when you actually sit down and talk to them, you realize they're, they're just, just human beings. It's the love that I love about the organization, you know, the, the genuine love. I think I then became addicted to health, you know what I'm saying, and running, and a good, a good addiction this time. And of course, the endorphins make you happy as well. Back on My Feet has chapters all over the country, from Los Angeles and Dallas to Baltimore and Philly. Nationwide, they've helped some 1,500 people battling homelessness.